The placement of a quad lumen monitor can allow for the collection of different types of data, including intracranial pressure, brain tissue oxygenation, cerebral blood flow, and electrical activity. Our protocol allows different types of information to be collected in severe traumatic brain injury patients at the bedside using a simple procedure involving a single burr hole. Immobilize the head securely to ensure that it does not move during burr hole placement. Rolled towels and tape can be used to help secure the patient's head. Begin by identifying the correct location for the bolt placement, 11 cm from the nasion or 1 cm anterior to the coronal suture, and 2 to 3 cm laterally at about the mid pupillary line. Sterilize the area with betadine solution and use 1% lidocaine with epinephrine for local analgesia. While the betadine is drying, thread each probe through a locking nut and subsequently insert each probe through one of the lumens of the bolt. Place the intracranial pressure brain tissue oxygen probe preferentially in the tallest lumen. The other probes can be fit through any of the remaining lumens. Confirm that the distance from the end of the bolt to the tip of each probe is 2.5 to 3 cm and advance the depth electrode until the most proximal electrode is just outside the end of the bolt. Once the probe has been placed the appropriate distance from the end